and fitness. And hitting the weights is really important to build up leg strength for cycling. So here's a few strengthening moves that you can do in the weight room to improve your cycling performance. Let's start with the quads and some squats. Now we want to add some weight to this. Keep our feet about shoulder distance apart. Inhale as we sit down as if we were sitting into a chair. Exhale as we stand back up. Again, inhale down, weight in your heels. Exhale, press back up. If it's more comfortable on your knees, you can spread your feet out wide and turn your toes out to the corners of the room. Gives you a little more inner thigh action and sometimes it's more comfortable for the knees. Don't forget though, cycling is a single leg activity. That's why we have to do some lunges as well. A reverse lunge, starting with the right leg and then the left. Keep your shoulders over your hips your chin up, and bend both knees, trying to create a 90 degree bend at the hip and the knee. Three sets of 10 squats and three sets of 24 reverse lunges, really going to build up the power in those quads. But we can't forget the hamstrings and the glutes. So let's move to the mat and get those worked out as well. onto your back and then extend the left leg up to the ceiling. We're going to be working the right hamstring and the right glute. Keep the foot flat on the floor and press your hips up towards the ceiling. Inhale down, exhale up. Again, working on that single leg strength that will put power into the pedals. After a set of 10, switch sides. And then with both feet on the floor, press the hips up, squeeze the glutes at the top, and perform another set of 10. Once again, make sure you're supporting yourself on the road by doing the work in the weight room. <laughs>